so here we go again what's going on guys it's a gph streams here and uh, today we will update the tier list so we have three new heroes and that would be dakiao guan yu and zhao yun and uh, first uh, let's uh, talk about uh, this uh, zhao yun so uh, in my past uh, video i talked about this attack speed and i am not impressed with this uh, attack speed that is only 107 but uh, the skill or the active skill of this uh, Zhao Yun is uh, pretty decent in which it increases the final attack by 25% and also the final crit hit damage by 20%. And uh, this uh, Zhao Yun here is like the higher tier of uh, Victoria. If we will compare him with Victoria, we can see here this uh, final attack that is 20% and but uh, we have here the crit hit rate. But of course, that uh, crit damage of Xiao Yun will be compensated by this uh, burn of this uh, Victoria. So somehow, Victoria and Xiao Yun are almost equal. But of course, uh, legendary heroes are always above this uh, compared to these uh, unique heroes. So uh, if we will check our tier list here, we have here Victoria at the first slot of this A tier. So I would uh, say that uh, I would put uh, Zhao Yun also on this A tier above uh, Victoria. So that is the placement of uh, Xiao Yun. And uh, also we have here Da Qiao. And if we will check here about Da Qiao, we have here the decrease of a final defense by 25%. And that would be 2 seconds upon successful attack. This was updated by the developers. From 1 second, it was changed to 2 seconds upon successful attack. And we have here also, it grants a critical hit rate increase level 5 to the caster only. And grants buff removal to the caster's basic attack and a critical hit. So take a look at that. Uh, this uh, buff removal only affects attack and a critical hit. So anything outside these uh, two keywords here are not affected. So we have also here the uh, critical hit rate increase and that would be 20 percent and this dakyao here is an independent hero and also a range hero so if we will check here wow this is a very decent attack speed that is a 157 and uh, the best thing about this uh, new hero take a look at that uh, crit hit rate that is a 3.75 percent compared to a uh, previous legendary heroes that is only three percent so later in the game or maybe in the future we can see now some uh, legendary heroes that will become power creeps <laughs> take note of that some of the legendary heroes will become power creeps so i will put a dakiao here in this eighth tier so next uh, we will proceed to the new hero that is a guan yu so if we will take a look at this uh, attack speed of guan yu that is 136 with a base crit hit rate of 2.25 and also a crit damage of 125 percent so uh, if we will check the basic attack that is a 150 and uh, we have here this a uh, veal that nullifies uh, three times in which uh, this is almost permanent except if this guanyu is debuffed so this veal will be removed and we have also here the passive skill in which it gains immortality for 5 seconds. And in addition, it grants stun and knockback immunity to allies. So this Guan Yu is anti-Kagura. So you can place this Guan Yu in the front row. So if Kagura injects the ultimate skill on the front row, this Guan Yu will stay in the front row because it negates the knockback of Kagura in PvP. So guys, in my opinion, this Guan Yu is best in PvP, not in PvE. And take note, that is only my opinion. And I will place this Guan Yu here at this A tier. So guys, we will update some of our heroes here. In which I have noticed in most PvE game modes, we don't need these heroes. So I will degrade these heroes. So number one, that would be Ming Ming. It will be moved to B tier. Also, we have here this Howl. It will be moved to B tier. And uh, we will move this Jin on the B tier. Because uh, sometimes you will need Jin in a PvE in defeating those range type uh, bosses. Next, I have tested this uh, hero here that is Snold. In which uh, 
he is a very useless legendary hero. So I will move him to D tier. And uh, we have also here Isabella. Uh, Isabella is actually great in uh, PvP. So I will move Isabella to B tier. So guys, that is our new and updated tier list. And I put the link on the description. And if you want to continue watching uh, this uh, video, I will show you my uh, achievements here. In which if you will check here on this uh, Essence Research... Take a look at that. I have here Ingrid. And this is a 10 copies of Ingrid. So, I already uh, completed this uh, essence uh, research on this Ingrid. And, wow. I have a 10 copies now. And uh, we can uh, advance uh, Ingrid now to 2 stars. Oh! Okay, that is only... Why is it that is only 1 star? So, okay, that is just two, 2 stars. So, I need uh, one more copy of uh, Ingrid in order to evolve her into three stars so if you will check ingrid here okay that is uh, already four out of five and uh wow this is nice haha <laughs> so let's uh upgrade that uh, codex okay actually ingrid uh, gives okay defense i see so uh on our uh influence tier here still i am a uh, 44 out of uh, 51 and on our traits here i think uh, we are more than halfway now okay yeah, we are more than halfway now. And that is uh, already 65%. If you will check at the uh, bar. Okay, let's unlock this. And on our relics here, we are now at a 134 as our highest. And uh, if we will uh, take a look at that, I am farming at a stage uh, 729. And this is a 4. I am uh, farming here for... Okay, let's check. And that is... Okay, this is a Klemeth. So I am currently farming the this a Klemeth. And uh, maybe... Oh my goodness. Okay, I am farming here early. So uh, if we will check here. That is a 729. 700. 700, okay. So uh, if we will check our pets. So what is the rate of a summon for pets? So we have here Pike. I see. So Pike improves accuracy. So actually, I have a. I should get one copy of Pike now, I think. So let's try to get uh, this uh, Pike. <laughs> so currently, we have here 100 uh, tickets for Pike. And. Uh, mm -hmm. So let's uh, do this, guys. Maybe we can get this uh, one copy of Pike here. Okay. I need to make that Pike to uh, one star. So that uh, we have some uh, decent accuracy. Okay. Nice. I need an accuracy pike. Give me that a uh, pike. Wow. So that is already 300. If we will spend only uh, 20,000. We'll make that as uh, 1.40. Let's see if uh, we can get a pike here. My goodness. You should give me pike. <laughs> okay. I really need that accuracy, guys. To be honest. My goodness. Give me that accuracy, please. Oh, I'm spending already. How much is that? That's. That is already almost 100k, I think. Okay, we have pipe. We have pipe. Nice. Woo. All right. So, guys, uh, we have pipe now. <laughs> and we spent 800. So uh, we can continue up to 1,000 so that uh, we can get these uh, tickets here. 
so that's one that's two okay three okay we are already at 900 and let's uh summon again four two three and uh, let's use times 10 okay nice that's great so guys uh, we can already uh, make our pike here into one star so that is a uh, plus 84 percent accuracy and if we will advance this take a look at that okay it becomes 88 percent wow that is a very huge increase and let's upgrade this wow that is 89 already so guys uh, thank you for watching and i'll see you again uh, next time bye bye